oh my gosh. I can't even tell you guys how many times I kept trying to come back in here and um, <laughs> get to my work. Um, but yeah, I and now I totally forgot how I had this set up. But um, let me see if I can come up with something. So yeah, I was, I don't know if I'm, you know, by the time this is up, if I will have decided to put a voiceover or not, but I feel like that's the way I had it. I feel like that's the way I had it. Of course, my little friend here had a head. Um, but I think I wanna, I feel like I want more people. Okay, here we go. I think I found some more um, scraps to use. So I wanna, like I just wanna make some like silhouettes of people, I guess. Um, you know, like little people silhouettes, because this looks like, you know, a gender neutral. This definitely looks like a, a woman or a young girl to me, or it could even be a pregnant woman, right? But um, anyway, okay, my pen is not working here. I am having a hard time with my pen, my, whatever this pen is, whatever kind of pen this is. I know it's a Jane Davenport pen, but I don't remember the the proper name for it, but um, let's make some people, like just some people figures that I can cut out, I guess, like different people silhouettes. This looks like his head or her head is like shape funny. Who is that? Oh, okay. I thought one of my dogs was crying just now, but it turns out she is, um, She's um, snoring. <laughs> so anyway, yeah. So you're probably thinking like, okay, you weren't talking a second ago. Why the H are you talking now? I just, I don't know. I felt like talking. I, I started working this morning. Well, you know, the speed up that you just saw or the fast motion um, you just saw a second ago. Um, I was doing I was doing that while I was doing like a morning prayer kind of thing um it's not something that I do every day but um I do try to do a little bit of morning prayer you know once in a while when I can remember um but um yeah so that's what I was doing and that's where I got that that very truly oh my gosh look very truly IU I'm it's supposed to be very truly, I tell you, or very truly, I'm telling you. Like, so maybe it's very truly, I love you. So I was listening to a Bible verse. Um, like I said, I was doing morning prayer and they were um, doing a few um, Bible verses. And, um, oh, you know, what would be cool is like a heart. Let me get a heart. I know I got one because I know that. I know I got one in here somewhere. Yeah, with the kitty, maybe? I don't know, we'll see, we'll see. Um, oh, here we go. No, not that one, not that one. I want just a plain heart, you know, maybe like that, no. I want it to be kind of um, like a neutral-ish color, you know, not too Valentine's-y. You know, maybe like, yeah, maybe one of those, okay. Okay, so um, that'll be cool. But yeah, so I was listening to a morning prayer through my old church, the church that I used to go to back when I was um, living in Florida. I went there for years, love that church. Um, um, and um, once in a while, I I try to catch, you know, like a, a YouTube morning prayer or a YouTube, um, church service just because you know my mo my mom would appreciate it probably oh i like that this one kind of looks like she's looking up right so let's have some so i've got like a bunch of people the same size let's have some some little people you know since i'm a little person i mean i'm not you know like a wee one, a little, little one, but I'm, you know, I'm, I'm not, 
I'm petite, okay? So we need some petite people. I want to be inclusive, right? <laughs> and um, maybe like, um, you know, some different different shaped people. Just, just people, y'all. Just people. Um, but yeah, I think maybe the, the, the reading, it was, um, from, well, there was, a, so there's an Old Testament reading, a Psalm, and then, um, a New Testament reading from, you know, the Bible. And, um, and, um, I feel like the reading that we were, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm ashamed to admit that I've forgotten already, you know? Yeah, I mean, I forgot it already, but I showed up, right? I showed up for church. <laughs> I showed up. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this person has a really long neck. <laughs> um, but I think just from, you know, just from, from what I do remember from the reading, I think it was the book of John in um, the Gospels because there's a lot of that kind of poetic language. There's a lot of, you know, truly, truly, I tell unto you and, um, you know, stuff like that. Um, of course, it has, you know, it depends on uh, which translation of the Bible um, one would be... Um, looking at or reading from, but I'm pretty sure that, um, that's what it was. And it just, I don't know. I just, I liked it. So I wrote down just that part. That's the part I liked. I like, um, I like poetic language, you know, I may not necessarily like, um, what the gospel reading was because obviously I don't remember. Well, no, I do kind of remember it. I do kind of remember it, but I'm not going to you know, I won't go into it now because I know y'all don't come here for that. Um, but, um, yeah, yeah. So now I do remember and, um, I might write something down about it or not. I don't know, but I just liked, I don't know. Somehow I just got this idea of, um, cutting out like a, a person silhouette, you know, kind of like a, see, I don't even need that anymore. Um, and, um, just kind of just writing down the part that I like, I didn't know if I wanted to include this or not. I did like it, but maybe, I don't know. I did like it. It kind of inspired me to, um, to, uh, um, make something like that, but I'm not going to do that today. I do want to make this page a little bit more dirty. Hopefully I'm in frame. Um, and I apologize if I'm not. But um, yeah, I want to make it well, just a little bit more dirty, just a little bit more. Um, maybe I want some of this Distress Ink. And I like how rough it looks. Ooh, now I've got, oops, I have glitter on it now, but so what? You know, so what? Okay, see if I can clean. No, I'm not going to get the glitter off of that, but it doesn't matter. So um, let me start gluing some of this down. So um, I don't know if I've showed you this glue. I know I was kind of trying to hand gesture with it earlier, but I just recently um, found out about this glue. It was $6.99. It might be cheaper um, on Amazon, but I saw it at Hobby Lobby and I... I try not to shop at Hobby Lobby too much because I think that, at least with the one, you know, the one where I live, I think it costs too much. But um, my aunt, my dad's sister, um, kind of told me about it um, on Facebook because um, she has began, um, well, begun, she's begun to... Um, make really beautiful um doll houses with her granddaughter and um so she kind of turned me on to it um because of where it's made it's made in wheeling west virginia where my daddy grew up and um you know that farm 
that I'm always, you know, running on and on about here to you guys. Um, that's where they're from. Well, it wasn't in wheeling, but it was, you know, close enough to be considered wheeling. So, um, so yeah, long story short, that's, um, that's why I, I bought the glue because I wanted to try it and, um, and I actually really like it. I don't know that it's, um, you know, I, I can't really say that I recommend it or not. I'm still kind of like, you know, trying it out. I don't know if I like it more than, um, more than, um, you know, Mod Podge or Tacky Glue. I definitely, as an adhesive, I definitely like it more than, um, matte gel medium lately. Um, I can't exactly say why, but, but I do. Um, but yeah. Anyway, you guys, yeah, I wasn't, like I said, I was, I was planning to, um, I was planning to do my nails actually. I know I'm, I feel like I'm always complaining about my nails. Um, <laughs> when I, when I'm filming, but it's because, I mean, because I know that I'm going to be filming, you know, at some point and we're going to be seeing my hands, you know, cause I have to look at my hands when I, um, you know, when I'm editing, I think I don't like this, um, this brush and I think I need, I think I need some water. Oh, I hope I was in frame. But yeah, I don't, I don't, I think I don't like that, um, that brush with this glue. I need a stiffer, I need a stiffer brush. Okay. So, um, anyway, yeah. So as I was saying, I'm, I really like this glue. I'm still kind of learning, um, you know, how it performs as an art glue, maybe not necessarily as a, um, a um a dollhouse glue you know i can't you know i can't exactly say so i think what it's gonna say instead of saying you know very truly or truly truly i say unto you because um you know that's what was in um the gospel reading that i was listening to this morning um you know it was part of a conversation that um jesus was having with someone in um, the story, um, I think, and I just liked it. I just, I really like poetic language. I mean, that's why I like, um, you know, I like that kind of old school, you know, beautiful language. You know, when people said thee and thou and um, therefore and like all that stuff. <laughs> um, I just, yeah, I just, so I just wrote it down. So I think I'm going to put, I'm just going to put that very, very truly. I love you. You know, ah, oh, Mouser, Mouser's barking. Let me go see what he's barking at. Okay. Yeah. He's barking at a, he's barking at a truck. I don't know why. Um, Cause, well, no, I do know why. It's because he likes to bark. He just, you know, they all do. They all do. So where do I want to put my people? My people. Um, so maybe this is, um, I don't know, an angel or a celestial being. You know, a heavenly, like a saint or... Um, you know, someone, um, and he's telling these people, I love you, right? Wouldn't that be nice? Isn't that such a nice thing to say to somebody? You know, I mean, especially when you mean it, you know, Mouser, I like it. I like it. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't know what's going on. Well, no, I know what's going on. Mouser's, Mouser's being a bad boy and he's barking. So, but what I do like about this glue is that it is very sticky. It dries clear. 
um, and it dries flat, you know, it's, it's thick, like it's a thick glue, you know, it's very, I don't know, it's very like, you know, like gloopy, it's not, um, it's not very fluid, you know, like Mod Podge is, like I can't, you know, pour it out, um, but it's, it, it spreads very thin, like it goes, you know, it goes on easy and it spreads very thin and I love that and it's it's very sticky you know so okay so I I want this person to be looking like he's you know talking to them I guess you know or her could be a him or a her but um this person is the one who's kind of speaking to them, I guess. I don't know. You know, sometimes my, my junk journal, like, sessions mean something. Sometimes they don't. I don't want to exactly say, um, you know, this piece specifically means anything but I mean I was listening to you know morning prayer while I got the inspiration for it sort of or at least while I started it and um so maybe it's kind of fun maybe it's a, like a little something a little bit spiritual right maybe I want this person this looks like a pregnant woman actually when I look at it when I really look at it hopefully I'm not out of frame um but yeah and um yeah like I was saying I don't do morning prayer every day but um um it's just something I try to do if I can remember you know if I'm if I'm making the time or if I have the time to think about it, you know, when I'm quiet in the morning with my coffee and my kind of, my morning chores are kind of, you know, either done or I'm procrastinating. I mean, it helps me to start out my day like that, not necessarily through prayer, but in like a quiet contemplation, so to speak. Um, if that makes any sense, you know, meditation, um, a ritual of coffee, you know, my morning watercolor, just taking like a five minutes to wake up, you know, kind of, you guys know what I mean, but yeah, so we've got this dude. So this dude is telling them that you know, he loves them or she loves them, you know, or maybe this is like my way of kind of interpreting what I was hearing spiritually, you know, I think because I'm trying not to be too preachy here, but I, you know, you guys know that I am a Christian. I, I, I am. And I'm, um, I was listening to, um, <laughs> a Christian Bible reading and, um, it was Jesus saying, you know, very truly, I tell, um, you know, truly, truly, I tell you, you know, he was saying something else, but from what I got from it was that he was telling these people, I love you. And I like that, I like that. So I'm going to, I think that's what it's going to be. You know, I think that's what it's going to be. Um, I think I'm going to let that dry for now and kind of, um, maybe even s switch it up a little bit kind of outline the shape of a face right here it's like the shape of a face um feeling like that's an eye but i think i should make it into a cheek um i do see a little eye right here I'm kind of seeing an eye right here I'm kind of seeing some lips sort of here um well that would make her nose like super small but um yeah 
Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe it's like a small face. Maybe it's like somebody who has a little, you know, like a little bit of a, a smaller face than, you know, if the lips are up here, then where will the nose be kind of here? You know, kind of there. I want it to be, yeah, and then the cheeks. And then, then what happened to our bird? I guess our bird is is no longer there. Right? This person has like a, you know, like a chubby little face, like a little, you know, not like a little baby, but a chubby face, I guess. I don't know. But just a little indication of a kind of a, a you know a person right yeah yeah cute right a little a little face okay maybe we'll make her cheeks really chubby like really like you know I feel like the eyebrows need to go up a little more. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Where's my little eraser? And I want to, I think I want to change her jawline a little bit, a little bit, I don't know. Yeah, that's better. That's a softer. I feel like that's a softer jawline and I don't know if I'm going to put some ears or not, but um, yeah, I like that. I don't have my glasses on, so I hope I'm not, you know, I hope this looks like something. I'm trying to make my pencil you know, my graphite strokes look deliberate. Um, yeah, so what should I do for the, for the hair? Mm. I want her to have kind of like, I want her to have bangs. I keep feeling like, I feel like I see bangs, but then I want her to have like, you know, kind of like a wild hair, I guess. I don't know why I feel that way. I just do. So, um, I don't know. Does that look like something you guys, does that look like something? I don't know. So is this dry? Yes. And see, that's another thing I love about that glue is she dries so fast and I love it. I love how fast she dries. So, okay, I'm going to, ooh, wait a minute, wait a minute, you know. Do I have any glue left on my thing here? This is sticking up. Where, where did that glue, oh, okay. So, okay. Um, as far as whether or not this glue is flexible, I don't think so. I think, um, I don't think so. I think this is just meant to be a, like a, you know, a flat glue, um, yeah, stick flat glue. That's what it's called. Ooh, you can use it on metal or glass. Awesome. So yeah, so it'll glue like all kinds of stuff. I don't know if it'll glue plastic, you know, but we'll try it out eventually. Um, yeah, so where's my pen? Okay, so my little pen here, I'm going to outline my... Um, 
my sort of celestial figure here, my saint figure, my um, my Jesus figure, so to speak, I guess. I don't know. I hope I'm not being disrespectful of anyone's um, faith right now or disrespectful of somebody who might not, you know, be interested in that kind of thing. I'm really like not, I hate, I hate feeling like somebody is pushing their, their faith on me, you know, which I promise you I'm not trying to do right now. I'm just, um, yeah, I was, oh no. Okay. I was just, I was inspired by my faith to do this. Yeah, I need, um, okay, so this, this, uh, glue, um, it doesn't work very well with pen, you know, so, um, let me see if I can get some ink. No, I don't know. I'm going to leave it for now. Let me, maybe I'll work on my little my little friend here, you know, maybe I will work on her and, um, ooh, um, maybe I'll just get some ink down in the negative space. So this is just watered down, um, Jane Davenport ink. I don't remember. Um, I don't remember which one it's probably blueberry. Um, but yeah, so let's just, maybe just to kind of, kind of tie these two pages together without really tying them together, if that makes any sense, you know what I mean? Just by getting this negative space, I guess. Okay, okay. Um... Maybe I even want to sort of, and I don't know if I can, I don't know if that's even possible, but sort of make some shadows, I guess, around her eyes and under the nose and under the lip and kind of around, just around where there would be shadows. I mean, it's not like, you know, um, yeah, yeah, like I may, I may have messed that up a little bit, but it feels right, you know, and I kind of want to water that down a little bit, um, but yeah, and it's going to show through here, so, you know, but that's okay, that's okay, um, and, um, okay, so I'm gonna let that dry. Is this dry a little bit more? Um, I feel like it needs more. Like, I don't know what it needs, but, um, but yeah, I guess it doesn't really need anything, but maybe I wanna get like a permanent marker or, oh, maybe this ink. Maybe this ink will do just to outline some of my my shapes just to give them a little bit more emphasis and sort of bring my bring my people forward, you guys. You know? Um you know, make it a little bit more um obvious that these are people like these are our silhouettes you know i guess yeah yeah so oh okay so i need to talk about the fact that in <laughs> my video that i just did that i just edited um, edited, 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 yeah, however you say it, however I'm supposed to say it. Um, so <laughs> I was just like, I just finished editing it, um, like yesterday and as of making this video and, um, 
Yeah, I like that. I like that, you guys. I, I really do. I really like it. I really, really like it. Um, um, I kept saying the word Copic stitch. <laughs> Copic. When I was mispronouncing it, it's the Coptic stitch. Why was I calling it the Copic stitch, you guys? Why? Why? <laughs> and maybe I want to put... Maybe I want to put a halo. You know, maybe I want to put a halo. Yeah. I'm going to color it in because I'm going to be putting some glitter and stuff. So I'm going to color it black. But um yeah, I'm yeah, I'm really sorry about that. Laugh at me. Put in the comments below, you know, that you laughed. Let me know because I was laughing. I was like here I am, like, you know, I'm trying to sound all confident and I'm trying to sound like, oh yeah, I know what I'm doing. It's the Copic stitch and it's like not, it is not the Copic stitch. It wasn't even kind of the Copic stitch, but it was a stitch that was inspired by the Copic stitch, if that makes any sense, even though it kind of doesn't even look anything like the Coptic stitch. See, I keep calling it the Copic stitch. Maybe I'm, that's my coping mechanism. <laughs> Maybe I just want to call it the Copic stitch, you know? But um, yeah, so I apologize for that anyway. Long story short, I apologize for that. And um, let me just, um, you know, apologize in general for butchering that particular stitch. But um but yeah, and I'm, I I said in my video more than once that I, I um, you know, it this it's not the Coptic stitch. It was kind of like I mean it is, but it isn't. I mean it's just kind of a stitch that I I'm not even gonna say that I made it up. I didn't make up that stitch. I just like it's just it just is what I do. <laughs> like um, that's just how I I stitch my my, you know, flat-ish signatures together by, um, you know, trying to do a Coptic stitch, but I'm adapting it, you know, into something a little bit easier for me and something that suits um, my, you know, my needs. But yeah, anyway, anyway, yeah, I felt like I needed to, um, I felt like I needed to, uh, like let you guys know that I know that I, I said it wrong <laughs> and part of me was thinking you know hello you're saying it wrong and you're kind of doing it wrong should you even post that video but you know yeah I should because <laughs> um, you know we all <laughs> mispronounce words <laughs> and um, that's what I did so um okay so let me I think I'm going to um <gasps> oh uh oh okay so I'm gonna um get some of this gold paint and um make a halo you know make a make a little halo around Ugh. but yeah I made a mistake because my my black ink is just um it's just mixing with the um yeah my black ink is just mixing with my um my gold paint now but I think I'll let that dry. I'm gonna let that dry. We're gonna fix that, you guys. We're gonna fix that. So, okay, while that is drying, let me see if there's something I can do here. Um, what can I do? Um, yeah, maybe I will make my lines a little bit bolder here. My, my, um, my cute, like my, hit me on my girl over here with the cute hair and 
the chubby cheeks. Why are my pens not working? What is going on? Is this, maybe that's still wet. Maybe it's, it's yeah, it's still wet. So I'll try to go where, um, I'll try to go where my, my paper's not too wet anymore. Um, I feel like her jawline needs to be a little bit more like that, but yeah, but that's good enough. You guys, you know, I'm not trying to be perfect. I'm not, you know, I'm not a realistic artist. I don't have that skills. I don't have those skills. You know, I don't have that skill and I don't have those skills. I just have, you know, my angel skills and I'm happy with that. So do I like her eyebrows a little bit higher? Mm. See, that sort of just changes it, just even adding. Adding some more of those, those lines, you know, adding some, some black pen, right? So yeah, and her nose, I'm not very happy with her nose, but that's okay. That's totally fine. Um, That's still still not happy with that now very truly i love you i feel like that's good enough i feel like you know you should follow somebody who loves you right we should follow you know the people who who truly love us who love us not necessarily follow but listen to them right <laughs> I don't know if that's what I'm getting out of this, but yeah. Um, um, I guess that's, that's it for now, right? I don't know. I feel like, I don't know if I want to do anything more to this or leave it or um, what. It's still kind of wet, but um, yeah, maybe, it, well, maybe I'll work some more on this a little bit more. I don't know. I'm not trying to. I don't know. Very truly, I love you. You know, what is the point of that? What is the, you know, what's the story on that? What is, what does it all mean, right? So that's still wet. I think I'm just going to maybe make my halo more 3D you know, kind of make it into a crown or something. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, yeah, I feel like I really royally messed that part up, but it's okay. Like, I don't care. I mean, I'm okay with that. I feel like this needs something. Um, um, do I have something I can use? Oops. Let's see if one of my oh, now you can't see that. I'm I need something light. Oh, I have a white. I have a white pit pen. I think this is a pit pen that I forgot about. Oops. Okay, I love that. Let's kind of whiten the eyes of my little friend here. So I think I want to repeat this orange color by adding some some butterflies here and there, right? 
Um, um, let's see if I can add another butterfly, but then that'll make four. I don't like even numbers. I need an odd number. Um, hmm. And then I need one more butterfly then, I think. Let's see if I have another one here somewhere. Let's see if I have another one. I do. It doesn't have to be orange. Orange. Um, yeah, I know. That's like a tiny detail, right? But, it, you know, it made a difference to me. <laughs> It really did. So, okay. Um, um, uh, let's see, is this dry yet? No, it's still sticky. It's still sticky, you guys. I feel like I want to make the background a little tiny little bit darker. I feel like that's really gonna make a difference. Um, although I normally don't like, I normally don't like to use black, but I definitely want to, I definitely wanna make my background darker. Um, let's see if I, Okay, okay. So I feel like oh, I'm really unhappy with this part. You know, I feel like maybe because this part, it's like it's too different from the rest of these, um, you know, these people figures. It's too, I don't know, separate. It's too... I don't know exactly. And like, I don't like this, the way that I did this halo, but it may just be because like I'm on top of it. And you know, when you're working on a piece, you don't like, um, you kind of don't like it while you're on top of it, but then you take a break and then you come back later and you like it. Um, I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, I know for sure it needs to be worked on. Um, I, yeah, I definitely do need to do something with it. Um, but I like where it is so far. I mean, I'm liking how this page looks and feels. I like how this page looks and feels, yeah. Yeah, guys, so, um, so yeah, so I'll work on her some more, I don't know when. Maybe, um, wait, I'm gonna, I just want to use up the rest of the, the color that's on my sponge here, um, just to like, cause her jawline was bothering me and it's still kind of bothering me, but, um, but it's okay. I'll, um, you know, I'll get with it later. But for now, I think I don't want this there either. I changed my mind on this. This has to go. Um, this can go, you know, somewhere else. Not here. One, two, three, four. I mean, yeah, there's four instead of five, but, um, but that's okay. I mean, it looks okay like that. I'm happy with it. Um, Sort of, <laughs> sort of, um, and I'll come back to it. I mean, I mean, that's what, that's what a junk journal is to me. I kind of work in it. I'm unhappy. I'll come back with it or I might leave it like that. I don't know. I mean, this was kind of like a good, not really a brain dump, but sort of a good, um, 
art therapy-ish kind of thing, sort of a, you know, expressing what was on my mind or at least what I was listening to and I had fun with it. And my hands are all dirty, you know, and this page is all dirty. And um, so yeah, <laughs> anyway. Oh wait, oh wait. So I was just trying to clean up and um, I found this, this one, this little one. This little person right here, maybe we'll put this little person here, you know? No, I, I, I wanna put this person here, but not until I fix this. I need to fix that. How can I fix that, you guys? I'm, like, I feel like I can't finish this video until I finish how unhappy I am with this and make myself happy with it. So, um, oh, what to do, what to do, what to do, you guys. Um, hmm. Maybe I should, um, let me see. Hmm. Let me get some gesso. I, I think the only way to fix it the way I like it is to paint, is to paint over it and kind of start over, right? I'm, I'm even going to paint over my heart right there. I think, I think that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, see, I'm liking that already. I'm liking that already. And then maybe I need to, so do I need to paint over the halo too. I don't know. I don't know. Let me just paint over this and see how it feels. See how it feels to me. You know, I feel like, yeah, I'm going to, I feel like, you know what it is? I'm, I'm, I'm not obsessed with halos, but I, you know, I'm taking an art class. Well, an art history class. Um, at my local college. Well, I'm doing it at home, but it's um, a local college here and I'm taking online classes. I've told you guys about this. And so a lot of the, the art that we were studying last semester and a little bit in this semester, um, there were a lot of halos because there was a lot of um, religious, religious art. And so, and I love, I love halos. I think even if I wasn't like a, you know, a religious or spiritual person, I would love halos, you know? It may even just be because, you know, my mom named me Angel. So of course, you know, when I was little, people used to, um, you know, make fun of my name and, you know, in a cute way. But, um, you know, people like my sister, one of my sisters, um, for Christmas or for my birthday, she would always give me stuff, you know, that had angels, you know, on it. Like, you know, if it was like, just for example, if she, she gave me a poster once of, um, of, um, some angels, you know, images to hang up in my room and stuff like that. So that was, you know, my grandpa would get, would give me angels. I'm looking at a, a, an angel that my grandpa gave me right now, like a pin, of it so okay so I like that I mean I like I think I'm gonna leave it white but as far as the halo I think I'm gonna let that dry and just um um like hopefully hopefully you guys this is not gonna you know turn out horrible you know, um, I'm just going to put, like, you know, maybe something more simple, you know, I don't know. I am liking that a lot more now. I am liking that a lot more. Yeah. Yeah, is this gesso dry? So the dress, the gesso is not, it's not 100% dry, but I think what I want to do is just, 
re-outline my little friend here. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, re-outline re him or her, you know. I um, guess I'll use my, my ink. Usually when I make a mistake, I take a break from it, but I don't know, for this session right here, I just, I felt like working through it. And I'm glad that I am. I, I'm glad that I am. I See, I don't even mind that the line here is like broken. Um, I don't mind that that gesso is showing, you know, like that it's, I mean, it's obvious to me that it's gesso and it's white. I mean, I love that it's kind of glowy. I do want to maybe put some glitter or something that looks like stars. Maybe stars, you guys, stars. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I don't know if I'm going to use these stars or these ones. I'm leaning towards these ones. And um, I'm going to have to use, ee, what kind of glue am I going to use? I'll try my craft glue. Hopefully it won't let me down. Um, hopefully. But yeah, I'm just going to put them, you know, randomly. Just randomly here. I don't have my... Oh, I don't know where my, um, my, uh, my tweezers are. I had some craft tweezers, or at least they were assigned. <laughs> I assigned them as craft tweezers, but I don't know where they are. So I'm probably, let me see. I don't know, that can be upside down. I want it to be on the gold side, so I'm going to have to. No, I don't like it. I don't like it on the, on the dull side. It has to be, it needs to be on the, um, I need to be able to see the shininess of my star. So let's see if I can use my little paper clip. Yes, okay, so I need more glue. I'm trying to make my my dots of glue here as random as possible. Um but maybe I'll put some stars here and there too. Right? Right. Okay, let me put that back. Yes, this is making me so happy, you guys. So happy. Oop. I mean, I'm not happy that I don't have, you know, craft tweezers for my stars, but I'm still making it work, you know, like I always do. I feel like I need more stars, but I'm not gonna, I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna try to keep it subtle for now because I, I feel like if I overdo it, I'm really gonna not, you know, I'm really gonna be like, you know, no, I overdid it because I'm finally happy with what happened here, you know, by making, making it white, you know, like, um, oh, let's see, let's see, okay, oh. So hopefully it'll stick. You know, this is not, this is, these uh, stars are metal and, um, you know, they don't exactly, um, you know, they don't always exactly cooperate with craft glue. You know, I should use a better glue, but, so how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, that's why, because there's six. six stars. I want to put seven stars because I like odd numbers. I like odd numbers. Okay. There we go. 
Okay, so we have this sort of, you know, Christ figure here saying very truly, I love you. And I love that. And let's put another little disciple or follower or, you know, I don't know, you know, here. And um, let's see. Okay, yeah, I don't want to do too much. I don't want to do too much because you guys know, you guys know how it is when it's like you get that feeling of like, okay, you should stop, you know, and then sometimes you get the feeling of, you know, you should go on and it's the wrong thing to do. So I feel like, I feel like continuing would be, um, you know, I would be like too much on top of it and, um, I wouldn't like it, but I do, let's see. Okay, so it's, this is white. I've got some white lines here. Now it's like, I need more white. <laughs> I need more white. So maybe I'm just gonna take some of this Distress Ink or Distress Spray Stain and yeah, make some white, make some white. Yeah, there we go, yeah. There we go, all right. Oh yeah. Yeah. Good enough. I'm happy about it. So yeah, so I feel, I feel like I did something. I feel like I accomplished something. I mean, yeah. And I, as I say in every single video, is this something that, you know, is ever going to hang in the Louvre? No, but it's hanging in the Louvre of my heart. <laughs> you guys, right? Cause I made it. I like it. It means something to me. It kind of repeats what I heard this morning in my, my, uh, my prayer, you know, my morning prayer, my little Bible verse that spoke to my heart. And so, so yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me. I had fun with this and um, I'm really excited to be, you know, working in my new junk journal. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I, I I feel like I kind of did everything that I wanted to do um in this junk journal for you know for now. I feel like if I if I keep going, I'm going to um you know continue being on top of this page and continue adding on and then I'm gonna get to where I'm like, no, I don't like it. Um but I like where it is right now. I, I wanna work on it some more. I definitely want to um you know, work on her a little bit, but, um, but yeah, I need to, I, I need a break. Like I need to stop because yeah, I'm going to keep going and keep going until I don't like it anymore. And right now I like it. And so I want to stay in that. You know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, anyway, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me while I did this. Thank you for watching and, and hanging out with me while I did this. Hope you enjoyed it. I will, uh, you know, try to get to where I'm making more videos. Um, now that I've got a really cool setup here and I know I keep promising a studio tour. Um, I'm definitely going to do that. I would have done that today. But um, I just didn't have the time to do that today. I'm, I might still. I don't know. But but I'll get that up really soon. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know um, what you think, what you'd like to see, if there's anything um, you'd like to see me do here, or if you've got any ideas to share, or just say hi, especially if you're new here. Um, say hi and let me know how you're doing. Hope you guys are having a great day, and um, I hope you guys are making tons of art and taking care of yourself especially um but yeah i will see you guys again really soon take care and uh, i'll see you later bye you guys